Is a robotic trash can a good thing? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Here's a fun fact. Do you know that a single hair braiding appointment can take up to 10 hours, if not longer, depending on the style and length of your hair? Mm -hmm. Would you be willing to stay in a hair? A, a hair? A hair, a chair. Inside of a hair? Would you be willing to stay on a hair, on a chair, at a chair for 10 hours? You Dr. Freaking Seuss, man? Well, I, you know I'm too tender headed for that. Uh, unless I was gonna like be transformed into an orc for the upcoming Lord of the Rings series. Is that happening? Yeah. I think Did you get the call? Was, oh, no. Uh, well, they must not have your number because they called me. Okay, but I would well, sit in the chair. Keep your butt seated right where it is. And if you're if you're like running right now or like on a skateboard, stop and sit down to watch this episode. I mean, that's not safe. Because we're gonna be testing an array of high-tech tools meant to take the hassle out of your everyday life, including an electric hair braider. Well, are they gonna be safe? I don't know. It's time for new tool or old school. We're gonna test a few newfangled home tech products and compare them against the more traditional ways of getting that same job done. And depending on how these fancy new items stand up to the old way of doing things, we'll decide if we should go with the new tool or stick with old school. Maybe you wanna buy some of this stuff. Utility in this episode. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a tall man, a big man, and big tall men have back problems, so I'm very familiar with the need to massage myself, but every time I ask Link to massage my lower back, he just looks at me and says, why don't you get a machine to do that? Uh, this is the why don't you Nay get a Pro to do that? Shiatsu Neck and Back Massager. Uh, this thing's got uh, heat function, different speeds. Basically, you just place this thing- $50? Onto your back. Highly rated. We're talking 4.4 .4 out of five stars, over 42,000 ratings. You get, you put your hand, your your hands in here to kind of like put some downward pressure oh, on, and snap. then you turn it on. Oh, it's starting to now, dance. It might grab my hair and just T turn, rip it completely him, off, like one of those. Him, give him that TikTok videos. I mean, you're not moving. That thing looks like it's alive. Oh, good. It's doing Lord, that to you? Oh my goodness! You know how there's the people we've talked about this before. The people who just like come up and start massaging you. But it's there's weird. a people. There's a people. There's a there's a personality. There's type, a people group, and they're like they the massage. They sort of emerge in like high school. Like everybody's too self conscious in middle school to do this, but like tenth grade, if yeah. you're a massager, you're like I think is when this is when I this is when I come out and start massaging people. You know, in the, tenth grade. There's another people group that likes to turn canes into massage type stuff, and oh. th this is the old school alternative. Instead of just going in there and using your hands, well, instead of us asking Stevie to come out and massage me, yeah. Thank after you. getting her to shave my back, it's oh, like, listen, I'm just Lord. gonna use this $25 cane, which you've had one of these, right? I have one you of just, those, but it right it's there, never made me feel like I this. I mean, the leverage that I oh, can Oh, it reversed, get. it reversed, I didn't even ask it to. Oh gosh, oh, and I love being able to hold my, I feel like a king just holding my hands in front of me like this. I mean, you are applying pressure kind of like I am. Yeah, pressure. But it seems like you're having oh. a lot <clears throat> more fun than I am. Oh, but you know what, there's something about this that doesn't feel right. The but, leather? You know, I think Twinkle Fingies can help me out though. I'm so tight. So oh, uh, <laughs> where are you going? I unplugged it. <laughs> I don't unplugged know where it goes. Oh, oh, uh, 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 uh. You're blowing it, Rat. Keep playing it. I'm gonna figure it's it out. Over. No. The song's not gonna last where, forever. Where do I? Where does it? It's dangling on the left arm. Right here. <laughs> don't stop. I got it right there at the end. <laughs> you didn't even uh, use it. Uh, I'm <laughs> sorry, I let everyone down, and All right. mostly myself. I mean, that's the review I'm writing. Takes the entire Booty Knot song to find how to plug back in. This thing requires no plugs. I mean, and talk about working your Booty Knot. Can you even work a Booty Knot with well, that thing? That's what I'm gonna try. I think you gotta put your arms in like this. All right, then play you... it again, Twinkie. I'm so tight, so stressed. Now, so no, let it do, in the, let it do the movement. You stop for a second. Yeah, that's. Ugh. Ugh. Look, it's working its way up. Look. Oh yeah, it's working its way up. <laughs> you better not goose me, man. <laughs> if you goose me, I'll never forgive you. Here, now try. Here, do it. Here, I got another idea. Here, let go. Now take it. Let, take it off your arms. Okay. 
And let's try this. Whoops. Which, all right. Oh, things falling off of me. So, you ready? You ready to play it again, Twinkle Fingies? Where are you gonna all put right, it? You step right here. Step where? Step right here. Right here. All right, hit it. I'm so tight, so stressed, oh. so shit. How about that? You gotta turn backwards. <laughs> How about that? Turn it, turn it towards me. Please. No, I want, I want. <laughs> it's like dancing boobies, man. <laughs> oh, oh. Dancing boobaloo boobies. No, I think this is it right here. Oh yeah. All right. Right there. Okay. You know the thing. This Cut is. Got it. This is pretty easy. Uh, this this is a no brainer. You like it for fifty? I mean, this is twenty five for twenty five more. And I gotta say, you get that thing. Uh, this is Jenna's. Uh, <laughs> she's over Jenna, there. Watch. I'm sorry. She's been watching the whole time. I just like. I feel like I'm like playing with someone's baby. <laughs> well, yeah. you're rubbing her baby on your booty. Yeah, I'm sorry. All right, so new tool or old school? We are saying new tool. Easy. For Easy. this one. This thing's great. Just twice the price of this. Yeah. All right, I grew my hair out for this uh, yeah. test here. Uh, I knew you had follicle yeah. power. I mean, and you see, it, yeah. is, it is gray under there. Look at that. Perfect. It's definitely my hair, which I want to braid in this twisted braid that I'm seeing everybody do. Yeah, everybody's doing it. But I don't it. want to do it with my own hands because I want to use a dangerous, uh, potentially dangerous, battery-powered device. <laughs> yeah, this thing is gonna get interesting, and we're, I'm glad you're doing it with the hair you just grew out. Uh, I'm gonna be trying to do the traditional way of braiding, and uh, I've never braided my hair. And we're not we're not doing, like Link said, this isn't the braid where there's like three strands, which I always thought that was what braiding was called. This is twisting indivi two individual strands of hair. A twist braid. And then just twisting those together. Now this thing, it only costs $11.50 on Amazon. Um, and this one's called Twist Secret. But if you look at it really closely, they misspelled secret. It's Twist Secret. SEO rat. Oh, you know, maybe maybe this will help with our SEO. Yeah, this will, this will, this will help with people searching for it. See it. And I've, I've looked at a tutorial video, but I've not actually done this. And it, it looked a little scary. So I know if I take two pieces of equal links, the reviews are not great. There's only 130 of them. Three out of five stars. Even the people who give it high ratings are still complaining about it. I'm going to take this and I'm gonna. That part was tricky. Just I'm right gonna there. pull this up, and I'm gonna switch hands. That's See, the initial I mean, part. I assume it gets easier the more you do it, but. And then I'm gonna take this one. I can't even see. Okay, and then I'm gonna. Put, I don't have fine motor skills. I'm gonna put this one in here. I scored pretty low on that. And then that. they need to be the same length, oh. so I'm gonna yank this back to where I'm to the edge. All right, Stevie, any predictions? Um, am, I, am I gonna lose all of my hair? I'm a little concerned, uh, but it's not your real hair, so I think it's okay. Just don't tell him that. This is my real hair. All right, so I'm gonna push up to twist each one individually first. Three, two, one. Okay, and now, oh, that kind of worked. And then I'm gonna pull it down to twist them together. Come on. Whoa, how's that, did that work? Is it yeah, working? Dude. Is it working? Stop it! Okay. A little too much. Is yeah. there a reverse on this thing? <laughs> that did that did that happen? Did I'm, I get a C I, I, I think you got a, a killer braid. Cigarette? That's really uh, gonna hit that CEO. I went a SEO. little too far. <laughs> and then so then to release it. Oh gosh. Like that. And now I need a You need a little hair tie. Oh, I lost it. I lost it. I've lost it. No, that's better, that's better. Okay. Last time I, you know, I was in charge of Lily's ponytails when I was <laughs> I was in charge little. of Lily's ponytails. Like when we would go to church. You should have seen me. I was I mean, a ponytail man. It was chaos trying to get ready for church. Hey, it's not perfect, get back in here. What is being in charge of a ponytail and- I hey, did the ponytails. But you didn't do braids. No, I didn't do braids. I just yanked it through the thing. All right. I feel like this is happening. And now, how's this? I mean, that's pretty good, right? Oh, did the thing just come off? I mean, I'm holding it against my my hand so you can see that. Oh gosh, part All right. just came off. Let's make a decision. Well, hold on. 
first of all, what you've done is nothing. <laughs> this looks like you've twisted hairs together. Yeah, that's basically what's happening. I mean, you gotta twist them into, look, I, I mean. I did, I did that, but then I, I bet you when I get this thing on the bottom, which is gonna take me a second, look away. You know what I call that? A dumb man's attempt at a dread. And then this goes in there, and then this. I mean, I. This. It is cheap. Look, see now. But it feels, it feels like. <laughs> this I is, mean, I look awesome. I no. mean, I think I look better than you. No, you don't. I think I, I think my technique. First of all, what we really needed is we needed somebody who has braided their hair before. I partially blame myself for this. I I didn't want to say it, but I do. I wasn't monitoring you close enough because I don't understand what you've done. And I did what the th I, I know how to do a regular braid with the three strands. This twisty twist thing, I think this was just a setup. But you know what? I think it's gonna curl real nice when I take it. New off. tool or old school? I think we're saying neither. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Quick reminder: Episode four of Ronstadt, the scripted audio podcast that you can immerse yourselves in the comedy, in the thrills, oh. in Rhett, being Ronstadt himself, That's and me. me playing some other characters. Uh, you can catch up, check it out wherever podcasts are found, and be sure to follow mythical.com slash Ronstadt. Now, one of the best things about having children is uh, you can just never touch the trash again. You know, I make, uh -huh. I, I make, no, I know how you are, you're a control freak, but my kids, I just make them touch the trash. When they go off to college, I am gonna miss them, but the main thing I'm gonna miss about them is that then I'm gonna have to touch the trash again. Well, I, I can't believe that you're actually claiming that your kids follow through with actually touching the it's trash. It's just trash. No, I'm just saying I can't, they're supposed to do it, but I actually want a machine to do it. Right, so this is the Talnu T3 Slim Automatic Trash Can. Apparently, what we've been told is that this makes the whole idea of bagging your trash like tying it up and getting it ready to go, it's done by a robot that's living in there. I have high hopes, because I mean, I always have the dog dookie bags in my house, and then you're like, you're throwing the dookie bags Hold in. Hold on, are you telling me that what you do, you get your dog's dookie, you grab, you bag it, and you come in and you just throw it on the floor and they're all around the floor? No, but this is what they've given us, so <laughs> I was like, so you're just trying is to this how make the story believable. I, the, the, the thing is, you've got, I mean, you gotta sit here and like, oh, I gotta, I, I usually take a piece of trash. Oh, that's that, recycling. That's not too That's dirty, recycling. And I use that to start plunging stuff down, and then I'm, you know, closing this thing up. It's it's not the easiest thing in the world. You're making it seem harder than I think it is. <laughs> well, you're, you're you touch the trash, and then you're trying to get the thing closed. I'm getting ready to spend $160 on this thing if it works because- Is that how much this costs, 160 I do not, yes, I do not like this. And then you gotta sit there and you gotta pull this. This, I mean, this is turning into a freaking infomercial. Yeah, and I'll tell you, you're- And then you've gotta- You're being very frantic about it. You, you gotta go like You're this. doing a great job. This would, you would be Put good at infomercial thing because you're making it seem harder than it really is. No, don't forget the blow. The blow? You don't blow in your trash can? Well, my kids do it and I've never seen them do it. I've you never got, seen them blow the trash can. I tell can. my kids to blow in the trash can to get out the air bubbles so that you're not putting less trash in. And then you've got to cinch that around there. It is not easy to tr to change the trash can correctly. Well, let's see let, if this let me show you how easy it is. Oh, <laughs> I like that. Hey, hey, this is my part. I'm gonna act like Link. This is my, this is my part. Let me do it. <laughs> I thought you said, this is my part. Okay. Oh. Oh, 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 just close oh, on your hand. Hey, come on. Come on, Oscar the Grouch, stay open. Oh, it wants to shut down, doesn't it? It opens just, uh, opens just for a second, and then it lets you, oh, okay. Everything's good, it closes. Then you just press this little button and the robot goes to work. So, what's happening? We can't see what's happening. It's beeping, it's churning. Whoa, 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 look at this, it's making a new bag. No, it's it's heat sealing the bag. Look, it's, oh, it, I don't know if you can see that, but it's getting, it is getting hot in there. Like there's, there's a coil. There's a burning ember. <gasps> look, at smoke. Look. And then I just take it, I take this, pull it out, and watch, it'll close. Watch this, watch this. It responds to my hand commands. And then? Yeah. It, oh. 
doing another bag. But did it blow? It blew itself. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Look at that! It blew itself! That's better than a child! There's no freaking, there's no bubbles in there. No bubbles in there! And look, it's completely sealed. It's Not a freaking sponsor! Heat. Oh, what's, what, 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 uh-oh. What did you? I'm, I just, I'm you making. Hit, you hit the button. You shouldn't. I'm making a you balloon. You shouldn't hit the button. I don't know, this thing seemed to work pretty flawlessly, except for the time it tried to bite my hand off earlier. Uh, look at that. You just got a bag of air. Look at that. Is that a bag of air? Yeah. Okay, I don't it know. Makes, it makes air. It's, it is $160, but I mean, having a child costs, I don't know, it's, I think it's like at least $5,000 at a hospital. And now. you know what? When you, when you, if you use this in the bathroom, like the nasty nasties that go in, in the trash can. You're talking about feminine products? You don't want to, all that type of stuff. What else are you talking about? I mean. What are you throwing away in there? Anything that you throw away in the bathroom. You put the toilet paper comes out of your, toilet, right? any orifice then you don't want to touch it. I love this. Okay, so the town new T3 Slim automatic trash can. We're saying new tool all the way. Link's taking it home. Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. Yeah, I mean, I feel like they should be paying us, town new. You know what time it is. Hey, Rhett and Link, my name's Sammy, and I just graduated from Baldwin Wallace University here in Brew, Ohio with my master's degree to become a physician assistant. Thanks so much for keeping me sane in the last two years. And now it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Congratulations! Yes. And thank you. Click the top link to watch us discover the prices of vintage school supplies and go mythical more. And to find out where the wheel of mythicality is gonna land. Check out Ronstadt, the scripted podcast we're starring in on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you get your podcasts. And be sure to follow so you don't miss an episode.